T from T Cut Me here today. Um, let me turn that down. A lot of people ask me this question How do you start an LLC? How you start an LLC in Maryland? Um, Maryland, you want to go to the website is maryland.gov backslash business express you go there you make an account it'll walk you through the process now the process will go like i said it'll walk you through the process but the process will go like name your llc you got to pick a name a unique name and nobody in at least maryland is using or nobody I think similar is using in the same field. You're gonna have to do your own research on that, but pick a unique name, right? Um, then you're gonna have to have a registering agent. The registered agent will be you or whoever you want to put the business name in. They'll receive all the documentation on the business. They can be responsible for the business legally. <clears throat> um, articles of organization is gonna be next. That's what a lot of Banks will ask for um, a lot of um, a lot of people will ask for this for verification that your business is legitimate and in good standing because it's something called good standing and not a good standing here in Maryland specifically. Um, and then this last part is uh, you will go to the let me see if I can find the website. I know it's the IRS website, but it, it's it's pretty long. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to Google. And you're gonna Google get EIN link. And the first link that pop up, um, not the promoted links, if they do pop up, is gonna be an irs.gov link. And it's gonna say apply for employer identification number. Um, this EIN number is pretty much the social security number for the business. So you're gonna need that and you're gonna need the articles of organization. That's also gonna be the verification of that your business is active and it can stand in and um, doing business as you have to pick one of those, but that's 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 the um, the, the doing business as name. That's your, that's the same name as your LLC. Why you have to do a DBA name is because it's not your name. If you were doing business in your own name, then you could just open an account in your name. You could do everything in your name. You could do business in your own name, but a DBA mean doing business as. So. Um, since you'll be doing business well since i do business as t cut me and i do business as laurel beauty bar those are dbas um and it, it's pretty much a simple process uh i'm going to drop the links below and make this process real easy for you um as far as pricing i think articles of organization is a hundred dollars i want to say um i think that the total process might be like two something but keep in mind, um, you're gonna be responsible for taxes and all that other things too. So look up all those things. I'm not um, a lawyer, a tax lawyer or anything like that. So I, I, I can't give you tax advice, but this is how you file LLC. It's not that big of a deal. Um, people overcomplicate the process a lot and it's not that hard. Um, I think LegalZoom will charge you maybe four or five hundred for this process but you can do it yourself why well, say you should do it yourself because you should know these processes even if you're not going to do a few in the future because that's not your business you should at least know the process um when you enter something but um that's how you start well that's how you follow llc in maryland it's going to be similar in other states if you're in a different state i would say go to google and google file llc and then put your state name a bunch of links going to pop up legal zoom and all these other things don't click on those click on your state link if you can't find that on the first or second page go to your state's page and try to find where you can follow llc read up on the process for your specific state the things you have to do and like i said it's not that complicated um Maryland might be one of the more complicated states. It might get more or less complicated here or there, but um, don't overthink this process. Just go and do it, a couple hundred dollars, put it together, file your LLC or many benefits for filing your LLC. Um, 
pre pretty much LLC mean well LLC actually means limited liability company. So what it does is separate the liability from you and the company. It, it gives you a wall of pr protection. If something, God forbid, goes wrong with one of your companies, it's on a company and it's not on you personally. That's what the LLC does. But go ahead, file your LLC. That's going to be one of the first steps to business. But you know, the ultimate step are, are the transactions, the clientele, the um, sales and stuff like that. But get your business part together.